the next time I get my nails done, it's gonna be for show day. Welcome back to the prep series. So we are two weeks and five days out. That's crazy. So we're getting super close to the first show of the season. So of course, I'm gonna take you guys through a day in my life, show you what my protocol is like. I just did my first session of cardio, which was 45 minutes. I did have hit today. So 20 minutes of that was sprints on the treadmill, which honestly, I kind of enjoy. Even though I'm super you know, drained and low energy. It kind of like spices it up. It, it's like less boring than 45 minutes of steady state. Um, so we got that first session out of the way and I'm about to go get my nails done. I just showered up, got ready. We're gonna have my first meal. And I did prep all my food last night ahead of time. So that will make it nice and easy, but we have a high carb day. So I was on four low carb days the past few days, really feeling it. I know I've sound very chipper my energy you will probably notice throughout the video will be very up and down i'm trying to stay positive and i've been very happy today i really really am so happy with the way that i'm looking right now i'll show my check-ins here that i sent to my coach but definitely moving in the right direction it's been a really fun ride and i'm i'm just ecstatic with the package that we're gonna bring and we still have some time so we have basically three weeks to the first show of the season, which is my regional show. Um, I've never won an overall at a regional show, so that's my goal for this year. And then we go to the first ever national show that I've, I've ever been to. I've never stepped foot on the national stage, and that will be a pro card attempt. Um, but we're just gonna bring my best, you know? So we have five weeks until my first national show, so we have some time to bring everything in, but I'm super excited. But it is time to eat, so let's have some carbs. <laughs> I'm about to have meal one, which is some chicken and rice. So I'm super excited to have carbs. I haven't had carbs in like two days. <laughs> so um, yeah, basically just depleting, trying to get stage lean, right? This is not realistic. Um, I always want to disclaim that, that like this is not healthy long term. And basically, I'm just depleting my body to get stage lean, and then we will reverse out of it. So I'm excited to share with you guys that too. I have a lot of content ideas for staying informative on my reverse diet and how I maintain a healthy lifestyle outside of bodybuilding. So we'll jump into that after the show, but I'm about to go get my nails done, so I'm going to eat this meal. We have a nails, and then I am going to hit legs later, so it's going to be a really fun one. I'm going to bring Emily with me. You guys know Emily. She's my roommate. She's one of my best friends, and now she is editing my videos, so you guys will get to learn her more, but she's going to film for me, so that'll be really fun. But Boo is out here on the patio with me. She loves it out here. <laughs> going with something like fun and bright a little french tip with chrome and some hot pink i feel like it's very me but i realized that the next time i get my nails done it's gonna be for show day which is crazy so it's like we're gonna have to do something fun it's time for a meal so i'm going to eat and then we're gonna get back to it <laughs> This meal is whitefish and rice, so I get another meal with carbs that isn't even my pre-workout yet. Um, but I did end up switching to mahi rather than tilapia because one, it tastes a little bit better, and the mahi from Costco, like at the frozen section, is only like three or four dollars more for a three-pound bag of mahi over tilapia, and it's wild caught instead of farm raised. So I switched to that, and then I threw a little bit of chopped onion and truff. Um, the hot sauce and cilantro on top and then I mix it together All right little fit check. So we're about to head out to the gym and train 
glutes and hammies so I threw on some light blue shorts and a white sports bra and threw on this little crop top over top and the sweatpants and of course my flat shoes that are a little bit busted up but you guys get it. I just finished up some stuff for school so I'm still finishing up my summer classes and then I graduate in August so we're getting that done and I worked on some stuff for the social media pages that I manage and we're going to prep my pre-meal, prep my post-meal, head out to the gym, train a client, train myself, and then do some cardio. All right, meals are prepped. So hi there, we have our pre-meal here, which is chicken, rice, and almond butter. You guys know my favorite. So much rice, so much more than I'm used to, which is awesome. And then I have my cream of rice with some cinnamon thrown in there, weighed out, which I'll make at the gym after I lift, and then my whey protein isolate, which is my post-meal on my Heidi's. in the gym microwave i feel so obnoxious gotta do what you gotta do i'm so excited for this though carbs let's go all right oh hi boo <laughs> so i made it back from the gym <laughs> and today's been just such a good day so obviously prep there's so many highs and lows and i'm definitely on a high today obviously it's a high carb day so that helps but um, I've just been feeling really good and feeling really grateful and everything in my life has been so so great but I've been in such like a weird mental funk and I think it's just like prep really desensitizes you to everything and I'm somebody that gets really anxious on prep it's just the way that my body responds to lower food a lot of stress on my body that sort of thing so today is one of those days where I've really like taken to heart like how great everything is and my mindset's in a really good place and you guys will see throughout the prep series my energy comes up and down and I mean I do have caffeine in my system so that always helps but I am feeling really good today I'm feeling very grateful for everybody that I have in my circle you guys saw Emily filming me today I don't I don't know what I would do without her and I was talking with my coach too I'll read you what I texted him so he was telling me that I need to dial in these last few weeks he's like don't film like don't set up your tripod head down headphones on and just really focus on your lift 
And of course, like I want to get content out for everybody. So it was really, really great that Emily was able to come and film for me today. And I think that was really a big reason why I had probably the best lift I've had in weeks. Like I felt just great today. And I, I think it was because I was able to just zone in and just go hard and not think about, okay, let me set up my tripod. Let me change the angles. I was really able to lock in and I was feeling really good. The extra carbs definitely helped me today. Had a lot more energy, but it was a great, great, great lift. I had a great pump and it was just awesome. And it's one of those days that reminds you like, okay, this is why we do this, right? I love it. So I'll show you guys the text that I sent Adam. It just had an awesome lift. I really dialed in today. Didn't think about setting up a tripod and it's the best lift I've had in weeks. I'm getting so excited. And he said, yes, this is the text I wanted. Let's keep this momentum going the last few weeks. They will fly by. Time to shock a lot of people. That? Well, what can you say, right? And we just had a chat after my lift because he ended up coming to the gym and we talked for like 30 minutes just about moving forward protocols, like all the plans that we have. And I won't get too deep into that because that's like personal to me. Um, I'll share more about that like in the future. But really my goal for this year is um, I'm just gonna show up as the best version of myself. I know that that sounds so tacky and so repetitive, but truly I think so many people rush to their pro card. And obviously like that's the goal. Like I would love to get my pro card, but I'm also not gonna put a time limit on it. You know, the time will come when the time will come. I know that I will be a pro. I know that I live every day like a pro and it's just up to the judges, right? I'm gonna bring what I can bring. But with that being said, I wanna enjoy my time in the NPC. I wanna enjoy my time being competitive at shows because once you get that pro card, it is very hard to ever be competitive again. And once I do get my pro card, I will be taking like a year, two year off season to grow, right? So I just like really have had some clarity recently and I, I wanna do well and have fun and go to all these shows and really enjoy my time instead of rushing, like, oh, let me get my pro card. And then I, you know what I mean? And then you lose sight of the journey. So that's just something I've kind of come to terms with. And we were talking about that and just kind of plans for this year and moving forward. and. I'm excited to grow even in the off season. Again, I don't want to look too far ahead because we still have some work to do, right? But I'm really excited and I'm so excited to take you guys along with me for the journey. I'm sorry I'm rambling on, but that's what happens when I have caffeine in my system and I'm in a good mood, so I'm sorry. I hope you guys are enjoying this series as much as I am because I just love putting out content around this for you guys. And let me know if there's any like anything specific you guys want to see or know. But I'm excited for all the content coming up. Anyways, I have a posing call with my coach in a little bit. And I do need to catch up on some homework. So I'm going to do that as well. I will catch up with you guys in a little bit. All right, I just finished up posing, showered up, and I'm having my next meal, which is sirloin steak and green beans. So it's always a good day on a high day because I get steak and that always makes me feel really good. I am very, very tired now. So I am going to eat this meal and then I'm going to head to bed. I do have one more meal before I go to bed and that is just white fish and green beans. And I'm going to wake up tomorrow and do it all over again. But I will see you guys in a few days with a new prep series episode. Be sure to like this video if you enjoyed it, subscribe and follow my Instagram and TikTok so I can keep up with you guys on there and I will see you guys soon. Bye. Thank you.